Hey guys. How are you, friends? Hey, my friends, I know it's late, but I got carried away with my um, group tonight. Normally, we have our, <coughs> our live sessions. We have them on Thursday, so I we got, uh, we were running a little behind there tonight. So, <coughs> due to technical issues, and then finally, once we got started, we got into it, and it took us a little bit longer. So, but I'm glad to be here with you guys and to get our five day, five days of video straight going uh, all the way to Monday, right? So, thank you for being here with me tonight on such a short notice. Graciela, how are you, Graciela? It's been a while, Graciela. How are you doing? Are you doing okay, dear? Okay, my friends, so if you can just do me a favor, guys, and let me know if you hear me okay, because I'm getting crazy messages from my Mevo app saying that you guys might not hear me because my sound is bad. Can you tell me if Mevo is telling me the truth? <laughs> hey, Beverly. <laughs> okay, guys, so thank you for joining me tonight, my friends. I know it's late, but let's go ahead and create something. This is not going to take us a long time, okay? So, this is something... Hey, Debbie! Okay, there you go, Debbie. Way to go! <laughs> okay, guys, this is going to go fairly quick, okay? Because this is a very, very, extremely easy, simple wreath, okay? Now, this is a wreath that was requested. And uh, some of the requirements are that it's got to be simple. And it cannot be very big in design and dimension so this is not something that i normally do but <clears throat> it's okay because it's a customer request and i am happy to do it okay so the requirements are it, it's gotta be purple it's gotta it's gotta be purple in color and uh the thing is that it cannot be very thick hey beverly because guess what she's got screen doors um and she likes big wreaths too so this is a big wreath but she likes them very at the same time very um very simple not full not not anything like what i like to do i normally like to you know add a lot of stuff and i cannot I cannot do it not only because it's not her style, but also because, like I said, she's got double door, and uh, so it won't fit in there. So we're going to go for something quick, and so I'm trying to uh, see what other things I can add to it without really making it look too busy for her. So what I'm going to do, because this is a very large wreath, and I cannot put a lot of stuff on it, I'm going to use some purple ribbon, and I'm going to wrap it around this wreath just for some highlight of color because we're not using a lot of flowers on it and we cannot use a lot of greenery on it either. Hey Carolina, how are you? So I am going to just be going around just because, you know, she just likes purple. So I'm going around with a purple, uh, purple, uh, what am I trying to say, guys? It's late. With purple ribbon, because this is what she wants. She likes purple ribbon and purple color. So this is what I'm going to do. So I'm just going to go ahead and add a little bit of highlight of color on here. And I am just going to wrap it up this way. Okay. And so I'm going to finish this here. Like so. And I'm going to cut this right here. And I'm going to glue this. I'm going to use this on a small ribbon I'm going to make. A small bow. And this hopefully will just dress it up a little bit. Okay. Just add a little bit of color in here. 
Like I said, she's a very simple woman. And she likes her decor then very minimalistic. So very, very, you know, compact and nothing really elaborate. Simple and pretty. Okay. So that's what I'm going to do. And then now I got me some lavender bushes. Very simple too and minimum. But at the same time, I think they're going to look cute. I think she hopefully will be happy with it. And I'm going to use some greenery, but it's not going to be big greenery either. So I got me several of these lavender uh, bushes. And then I got me some other flowers here. And what I like about it is that it... It's got some little um, butterflies too for some splash of color. I don't think that this is too much. So this is what we're going to place on here. Okay, so I'm going to start. I do want to create a, I do want to make a bow on here. But again, it, can, it cannot be a bulky bow because of the screen door. So let me know, have you ever done wreaths for screen doors or with screen doors? They can be a little challenging. This would be probably my third wreath for a door with a screen door. So that's why I'm happy that you're joining me tonight. Like I said, this is not going to take us long because it's not supposed to be an elaborate design. So we'll see. Hopefully, <laughs> hopefully I will keep that in mind and don't make it too big. All right. And we're gonna. Oh, and another thing is I was thinking, well, okay, I can play, possibly put a sign. No, she doesn't want a sign either. Because um, they want to be able to see through their door um, there through their wood door to see who's knocking on the door or anything like that so they don't want anything to get on the way I was thinking well maybe something lower you know but no they don't want anything so so it's okay not a problem you've never made a floral wreath girl <laughs> well I hope that you can find it um, that you can find it enjoyable and that you decide to give it a try okay all right so i'm gonna use this bush too my friends and like i said what i like about these is that they're not very bulky either and hopefully they will be perfect for what i'm having in my mind right now so we'll see hopefully you will be good i just gotta keep in mind that i cannot go very thick on this. It's okay to go tall, but it cannot be bulky. Because remember that I have that um, screen door to worry about. So I'm thinking that as long as I keep it, you know, within the outer part of the wreath, and maybe if I am using some of the front of the wreath, but not too much out here like this, like I normally do it too way out here, then that's not going to work. Because here, I have a door right here. I know, me too. They are my favorite ones. They are my favorite ones. So, just some requirements that uh, they have that I need to remember to do. And to follow. Yes, it's cold here. It's cold here in uh, Texas right now, guys. But, you know, I'll tell you that it's not very cold compared to compared to um, to what some people are having in the north. So, compared to that, no, we, we have summertime right here. <laughs> so, no, nothing, nothing, nothing. Nothing compared to what you, my friends in the north, are going through. Oh, 
Aw, oh, Diane. Thank you, honey. So see, guys, so I'm just going to try to keep the same pattern that I'm following right now. And I'm going to try to keep it just all in um, not very far out, okay? Because that's not going to work if I do it far out, the wreath. <laughs> Regina, right about after this, I will. <laughs> I was worried about you guys because I was doing my live on my, on my, on my, uh, in my group. And I was like, oh my God, it's already nine something. Well, pretty much 10 o'clock, guys. And I was, no way. And I said, no, but I have to. I was, I was thinking about canceling because it was too late. And I said, no, they're not going to be there anymore. They're, nobody's going to want to come to see me this late. And I said, you know what? I'm going to do it anyway because I said I would. So there you go, guys. I'm keeping to my word. And besides, I'm thinking, I know, Melly, that's exactly right. He said four to five inches. So I hope that this is four to five inches, guys. <laughs> I can seriously just not. So what I'm trying to do is I'm just trying to keep him very, like, very close to the grapevine. See, not, not very far out. Literally very, very close to it. So, uh, because it cannot be anything like what I normally do. It cannot be anything like what I normally do, guys. Because it will not fit in there. It, it's not going to fit in that door, in between the doors. So, I do need to keep an eye on that. So, if you see me that I'm going crazy, please remind me of that. Because... I might just lose, lose sight of it, and that would not be good. Let me get one uh, more bush. That would not be good, guys, because that's not what they wanted. What is it that you haven't heard about, Teresa? I missed it. Oh, Tanya. Thank you, hon. Are you telling me or somebody else, Tanya? <laughs> yes, 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 yes. So uh, that's why I was, you know, I got to tell you guys that um, it, this becomes a little hard for me. But, but it's okay because, you know, I, sometimes we got to do things that we are not used to making that often, you know, it's good. It's, it's good to be challenged sometimes. Just doing something a little bit different from what we normally do. That's good. I know. I know, Callie. That's exactly what it is on this one. That's exactly what it is on this one. So I'm just gonna go in. Uh, like I said, I'm gonna I'm gonna keep it very simple, very simple. Um, if I do add any length, it will be like on the bottom, you know, like going down the bottom, like that. Not so much right here on the front because it's gonna be flat on the front. Otherwise, my friends, like I said, that door is not going to close. So now let me, I'm going to add the lavender, start adding the lavender and see if how that's going to look. Because I got to make sure that it's also like a little on the flat end of things. It cannot be sticking out too much. So I got to keep it. Hey Ashley, how are you? I got to keep it very simple guys, very simple. I cannot go crazy on this one. Simple but pretty, you know. Simple but pretty. And I think this is going to look pretty. It's going to do just that. It's going to be very natural looking. Like, um, 
And this would probably take her all the way to summer too, so she can keep it uh, for a big part of the year. Yes, that's right, Bridget, on the inside. Now, I got. I do have to remember, though, that I cannot go too tall. I was thinking, okay, that's fine. I'll do it on here. You know, pretty in the center. But he says, no, I cannot have anything in the center because I like to... <laughs> they like to see when somebody comes in, knocks on the door, they have their eye on the door, and they want to be able to see who is on the other side of the door. Which totally makes sense, you know. It totally makes sense. <laughs> Thank you, Terry. So what I'm doing is I am putting some on the middle, but it's gotta be low, and then I'm keeping it all on the outside of the wreath instead of here in the front. Because this is the part that touches the other door, so that's where I cannot go too crazy on that. Hey, Nancy, how are you, honey? How are you, Miss Nancy? See, like that? It's going to be, like, very close to the, to the wreath. Yes, they do. So that's what I have. So, hopefully, you know, it will, it will turn out okay. Hopefully, it will be something they like. And that fits okay on their door so I just gotta make it as close as possible to the wreath just like a compact design that's exactly what it is just a compact design how is it looking is it looking good to you now here I'm going to make a, a little bow too. So I don't want to add a bow in here. It's not going to be very big, but I do want something. <laughs> oh my God. So I think it's going to look very pretty. It's going to be very um, natural looking, see? I think it's natural looking. Now i got to be careful with the high that I'm giving in here. Because remember, I cannot cover where they would be seen in here. So I'm going to have to cut some of this. That one is going too far out. So I'm going to put it up here. Like that. So see, I like how it's looking like that. I do like that look. See, like that, if I do it sticking out, that's okay because it's in the back, it's not in the front. So I have room for things in the back like that. Yes, I can do that. This is really cute. Really cute. Now the other greenery that I'm using is this. And I like it because it's very, very, see how it's not bulky? I think this is perfect for this design. Just something pretty. Now what do you say? Maybe I should bring it all the way, right? All the way around. Do you think I should? I think that would be good when it, you're helping me on this one, guys. I, knew, I do need some help on this one. So 
I think I'm going to do that. I think I'm going to bring it. Well, let's see, because I don't know if I'm going to have enough purple, guys. Well, I'm going to try. See, I'm okay with that. We're doing that. Well, now I need to change that because I brought it. Now it's go I have it going on in two directions, guys. I need to redo that. See these things? I need to switch them going in one direction only. Because now I changed my mind. I decided to go around the whole wreath. And so I need to go in one direction only. So I need to change this. It's okay. Nothing we cannot fix, right? Good thing is that we are still at a good point to do it. So I'm going to come back and do it on here. See? Now I have a more even design. Now if I don't I might not have it enough, guys, of the purple one. If I don't, that's okay. I can just get more and finish it. Finish it later. But at least I have it started, right? Because like I said, this is not going to take long to do. It's got to be very close to the gray one. Hey, Rita, why have you lost me, dear? <laughs> hey, Mary. That, that's right, Mary. Tiene remedio. Tiene remedio. That's what I should have done, like that. Because this can go, can go very big if I let them, but I'm not going to let them. See, that's better. Hi. Who just said hi to me? That I miss you. Pretty, huh, guys? I'm liking this. It's looking very springy, isn't it? What'd you say? Yay or nay? It better be J. <laughs> yay, yay, yay. be needing some more of the lavender so I'm gonna have to get me some more tomorrow maybe maybe okay there you go Ross I'm liking it too I think it's looking good what I'm liking about it is that it's looking very, very natural. Like very organic. That's the word I guess that I'm looking for. Organic. It's very organic. 
Well, I am definitely going to be needing more, guys, and I don't have any more. If I would have not done that part, I would have probably had enough, but because I did that other part, I'm going to need more. And so this is all I have. So that's okay. I'm going to have to get me more tomorrow. But I think this is going to look very pretty once I finish it. Wouldn't you say? See how cute it's looking? And I think that's all I have. So maybe two, three more bushes. Maybe more. Because see, I want to keep it like plain like this on the front. But I can also use a lot more on the outskirt, on the outer part of it. That's where the wow factor can come, right? So, see, I don't care so much about the outer part of it because that's not going to be touching the door. But the front part, I, that's what I need to take to watch. All right, so we're going to go ahead and use some of these flowers right now. And I'm going to try to use them like that. So not very like, see more like that, like some kind of highlight. And they need to be close to the base. I'm really liking this, guys. What do you think? See, they gotta be close to the wreath. likes or not or you're just thinking about it hmm? how about that my friends close close to the reef <laughs> see how I gotta repeat myself that guys over and over close to the reef because I'm so used to just leaving everything so far out that this is definitely, definitely making me think a little bit more, you know? I know, Ines, that's exactly what I was thinking. I'll probably more out here. See, something that is closer. Oh, guys, I'm really liking this. This is pretty. Okay, so see, guys, I was not going to keep you here for a long time. It's not that bad, is it? So I'm going to place this butterfly up here. See, like it's flying up there. Isn't it cute? <laughs> I know, Mary. I think that's exactly what it was needing, huh? I think that's exactly what it was needing, my friends. So I think I'm going to place this one right here, perhaps. Maybe close. There you go. Then I'm going to make me these smaller ones here somewhere. Like that. Very close to the wreath too. And see those little touches of white? It kind of makes it to look even prettier, like fresh, like a fresh look. Here, I got 
there. And this butterfly, I'm going to leave down here on the bottom. So that way I have one and then I have another one here. And I'm going to do it in the center, like inside the circle of the wreath. So that way it won't have trouble with the screen door closing. Like that. See, and now I can make me my little bow here. Oh look, I have another one here. I have another butterfly here, guys. I can make triangle. Okay, I think it's gonna go here. But let's go ahead and work on a bow, shall we? And then tomorrow, when I go back to the store, I'll get me maybe a few more bushes of the lavender. And that will complete it, right? I think it looks pretty. Very natural looking. Very girly, romantic, sweet, huh? What do you say? You like it? Okay, so these are going to be my tails. I'm going to do tails on this. And the challenge is going to be my bow, because it's going to be not a big bow. Because, you know, you know why. Okay, so let me think about it for a minute. So I think I'm going to do... Now, I'm going to cut me some of this other purple. Okay, so I guess I'm just going to do it here. And I'm going to undo only two of this purple. Just two. to do three two but I guess the interesting thing is going to be guys with this because it cannot be um, a very bulky bar right I'm gonna use this extra tails would look okay flat doesn't necessarily have to be very doesn't necessarily have to be bulky right if I can just do it like that if the door closes it can still close and it can press it a little bit and it will still look like in shape I need to bring this to the middle of the wreath Like so. So what do you think? And these are going to be hanging, obviously, on the bottom. So I don't think that will be an issue. So I don't think that that will prevent from the, the, the door from closing. 
just do like that. What do you say? And I am need to put this one here. So I have one, two, I will probably place this here somewhere. More on the outer part of the wreath, not get inside, on the edge of it, like so. What do you think? That's simple, isn't it? It's simple but pretty, isn't it? So there you go, I think that is good. So I think I probably need maybe, maybe about two to three more bushes of the lavender just to complete it go more on the edges of it around the wreath and that should complete it but i think wouldn't you say that this will take you very easily all the way through summer oh i'm loving this guys it looks so natural right Baby, I agree with you. That's what I'm liking so much about it. That is very simple, but it looks so wild. Exactly, like you just picked them from your garden. That's exactly how it looks. And so because these are all very thin um, ribbons, you know, it just kind of highlights, kind of ties it all up, right? All right, guys, well, see, I was not gonna keep you here forever. So I think that it went pretty good. So I'll just finish this tomorrow. And I think I would call this a success. I'm so happy with it. I think it came out very nice. Very nice, guys. Very nice. And I don't think that they will have problems with closing their door. It should still be good. need to clean a little bit yeah I definitely need more definitely because I can see still see some places where it needs it but that's okay that's an easy completion for tomorrow now I don't have to worry about it anymore alrighty guys we'll see we are done with today's design so this was great well, guys, this is just to show you that it doesn't matter. I mean, you don't have to use like a lot of mixture of a lot of different things. Um, and you can still do very pretty things with just very some very simple um, combination of small flowers and, and greenery. So I'm very happy with it. I think she will be very pleased with it. Okay, guys. So thank you for hanging out with me, my friends. I really appreciate it. And, no, Mary, my birthday is Monday, <laughs> but I decided to do five days of lives up until my birthday, which is Monday. So Monday will be our last day for of the five days. Um, so tomorrow we have a meeting again, okay? So hopefully I'll be able to go live earlier. And so, Linda, the lavender came from Walmart. Can you believe that? I, I could not believe it when I saw that there. And the flowers too. The flowers came from Walmart. Some very pretty bushes. Yes, yes, yes. Simple, simple, but very pretty. I, I liked it a lot. So I was, I was kind of like unsure. It's like, oh my God, how am I going to keep it? You know, that big because when I saw the reed being that big, it's like, oh my God, how am I going to keep it? How am I going to keep it simple? So I said, well, she likes purple. So I went, I went to different places and then I was going to buy some of the lavender at um, Hobby Lobby, but they, the bushes were really big, like long. And I said, oh my God, if I cut them, they're still going to be they're still going to hang and they're going to go somewhere. I said, no, I need to find, I need to go. Uh, then I went to uh, Michael's and I couldn't find exactly what I wanted. And then I went to um, Walmart 
to buy my cat some food and I said I'm gonna go by the florist and guess what I found it there and I said oh my god they had some bigger ones too that were really nice so I think I'm gonna I'm gonna stock up on those they're very nice and you can use them for so many things guys you know spring summer mother's day easter um you name it even for fall you can use purple too so you can just combine it with other colors and that will look very pretty so anyway my friends so thank you so much guys for hanging out with me i certainly appreciate it i'm not gonna keep you here any longer uh just go to bed rest well and i will see you tomorrow okay we're gonna continue so this is just day one Tomorrow, come back so we can see what other things we can do. Alrighty, friends. Well, there you go, Linda. Little did you know, Linda, that you were going to learn how to make a, 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 a read today that would go between your doors. <laughs> hey, Callie, they were pretty, huh? Hey, they have some very pretty bushes there too combined that are very cute. The color combinations that they're coming up with this year are really nice. I'm telling you guys, Walmart has been surprising me since last year. They are coming up with better things and the quality now is acceptable. It's uh, They have some cute stuff. They have some cute stuff. Alrighty guys, so let me let you go friends. Have a great night. I'll see you tomorrow, okay? So, do me a favor. Share my video. Don't forget to push that button. All right? I know you're still away because you're watching me. So, you might as well push that button as you are here. As you are going at it. <laughs> okay, guys. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.